Hi guys! Today, Story and I are going to share with you a way to make really cool, colorful flowers using just a plastic cup. And when you're finished, they're going to turn out kind of like this. Pretty cool, huh? Okay, so first, like I said, you're going to need a clear plastic cup. This is a little bit thicker. If you have a thinner kind, that's okay too. I'll tell you how to use that one. And you're just going to need the cup and Sharpies. Sharpies. And you're going to start by getting a plain cup and start to color with your Sharpie the inside of your cup. See how I already did the bottom already? And I'm just going to go around and add any kind of colors that I would like to my flower to make it really, really colorful. And you're going to go all the way around your cup. Okay, and then when you're finished, you're going to have your grown-up turn on the oven to 350 degrees. And you're going to get your cup, and you're going to get a piece of, this is parchment paper, and you're going to place that on your tin, and you're going to place the cup on top of the parchment paper and stick it in the oven for about 30 seconds to a minute until your cup starts to melt and you're happy with the way it looks. We did all kinds of samples and we'll show you how it looks when you do it for 30 seconds or when you do it for about a minute to two minutes, how they're gonna come out. And we'll show you that in a minute. So these are what our flowers looked like when we stuck them in the oven for about 30 seconds. As you can see, they're not perfectly round, but you know what? Neither are real flowers. But we thought they were really pretty and colorful. Now, if you keep them in a little longer for about a minute to two minutes, they really start to shrivel up and take on some interesting shapes. And I thought they'd actually be really pretty to hang inside a window to let the sunlight shine through. Now we're gonna show you a different way to do them if you want them to be pretty round. So if you want your flowers to be perfectly round or pretty close to perfect, instead of putting them on a flat tray like that, we experimented a lot, right, Story? Yeah. yeah. We came up with this method. If you get a muffin tin and you get a piece of parchment paper and put it around the muffin tin and get your cup and put your cup right on top so it's kind of snuggled in there and then stick it in the oven for about 30 seconds or so, it's going to come out like that, perfectly round. Now you can leave these as they are. I think they're beautiful. Like I said, on a windowsill or on a shelf. Or you can add some embellishments and turn them into flowers with stems. So these are what our flowers looked like after we gave them a stem and we stuck them in a little vase. Aren't they cute in the window store? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So again, this is what they're going to look like for about 30 seconds in the oven. A little bit longer for one to two minutes or if you did it the way I showed you over the muffin tin with the parchment paper that was only about 30 seconds long so you can choose any way you want you can try them all and I forgot to tell you if you were using a thinner cup you just lower the um, the time that you have them in the oven so instead of 30 seconds it might only be five seconds before they start to really melt so just stand there by the oven it's kind of fun to watch them melt right store yeah all right have fun bears bye